We start with news regarding confirmation that a senior North Korean military official defected to South Korea last year. For details, we connect to our Unification Ministry correspondent, Connie Kim. Connie, what do we know so far about this defected military official? Well, Don, Seoul's Unification Ministry on Monday confirmed a news report that claimed a senior North Korean military official fled to the South in 2015. The spokesperson, however, did not elaborate any further. North Korea's General Reconnaissance Bureau is a key organization of the North's People's Army and is headed by the party secretary handling inter-Korean affairs. Now, with the confirmation, it makes the North Korean colonel the highest-ranking official ever to have defected to the South. Seoul's Unification Ministry also revealed that North Korean diplomats have defected to the South in the past, but did so prior to the latest UN sanctions against Pyongyang for its recent nuclear and long-range missile tests. News of this high-ranking North Korean defector follows Seoul's announcement of 13 North Korean restaurant workers fleeing to the South last week. The North Korean workers are said to have defected because they yearned to live in a free society after realizing there was no hope under the North Korean regime. Seoul says it cannot rule out the possibility of additional group defections to the South. They say this is mainly because most foreign workers are pressured to send a substantial portion of their earnings back to Pyongyang, as well as a desire to experience freedom in South Korean society. I'm Connie Kim reporting on the latest North Korean defections. Back to you. Thanks, Connie, for that. Do keep us updated in our later newscasts.